police department uh, thought enough uh, to have a program to uh, acknowledge Black History Month, but also to pair it with a youth basketball tournament to get young people out and parents and everybody and to make good use of this fantastic facility that they have here in the city of Blue Island. We're, we're partners with the community. We want to reach out to everybody and make sure we embrace everybody, um, their, their differences, and we want to make sure that we are one. We are one community. Today we're going to be the referees for the, uh, for the tournament. We see some new faces out here, and that's, that's what it's all about, seeing new faces, letting them know who we are. We're friendly with policemen. So because we wear this big uh, uniform and everything, everything else like that, we're out here having fun. We want to have fun. We want to in interact with the community and make sure, let them know that we're here to help them out in whatever we can. I think that uh, this is a great step forward in building trust and building uh, teamwork so that we're working together, not against each other. And that's, that's important because really police work, that's what it's all about, is getting involved in the community and helping the community. And that, that's why this is a great event. It's going to bring us together, it gets us out with the young kids, uh, even, even other residents, and, and brings us all together as one big family. Providing a place where kids can come, uh, feel safe, have fun. It's, uh, it's vital to the community. And, and it, it was genius for the, the, uh, the officials to get that done. I mean, when you look at other areas, um, you, know, you know, other areas who might not have an outlet for kids to come, and we see the negative effects of that, so this is vital. Environments like these are great to facilitate communication between the police and the residents so that this is the start of building relationships and long-standing situations where the neighborhoods and the communities are comfortable with one another and I think the more opportunity where the police are able to come out and the politicians in the neighborhoods are able to come out and speak directly to the people just facilitates a better relationship ultimately which only helps the community. This facility is a great example of what we could do in a community as elected officials, as community leaders, with our uh, neighbors within the city.